here's your question of the day. What is the Mackinlay duration of a zero coupon bond? Remember what a zero coupon bond is? It has one payment at its maturity. Based on that, we can modify the Mackinlay duration calculation. You see the case of general case at the top of the screen. At the bottom, you see the case of zero coupon bond. And all terms go away. And if you look at it, in the end, what happens is everything cancels out and our Macaulay duration is in number of periods in the bond. And as you would expect, if you're weighting the bond by its cash flows, there's only one cash flow. It's at the end for a zero coupon bond. So its Macaulay duration is the maturity of the bond or the life of the bond. Let's give a very specific example. Let's say you have a principal strip. It is paid in three years. Remember, there's only one payment. Three years in the future, its Macaulay duration in this case is six, six semi-annual periods in the future or three years in the future. So there is what Macaulay duration looks like in the zero coupon bond case gives you a feel exactly of what the definition of Macaulay duration is and what it means in this case.